Chase Wilbur's sister, Brianne. We'll do a quick reading on her, see where she plays into this. And then we'll do the grandma too. I think right now what we're doing is getting our hierarchy, at least on that day. So we are going, I'm just gonna read regular Rider Wait. I wonder if, oh, two cards just jumped. Hold on, I have to think of a question. Let's do the grandma, Becky Patty, and then we'll do Brianne. So where does Becky Patty lay or fall in this hierarchy? I didn't ask a yes, no. I got all of the cards in reverse. I should ask a yes, no. I'm gonna ask a quick yes, no. Did Becky Patty have anything to do with this? These cards that are jumping, if you're in the bleachers, I'm just putting them back in because we're just doing a quick yes, no. Did Becky Patty? No, yes, no, yes, yes, soft yes. I'll give her one more chance, or, you know, best two out of three. No, yes, no, yes, yes. Yep, she did. Hmm. Surprising. All right. So we can put the Mike Patty. Yes. He reports to someone. Meyer. Becky Patty. Yes. Okay. Just do a quick reading on Becky Patty. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, corruption, corruption, corruption. All right. What I'm looking at, I'm just going to explain this to you guys. Here's our corruption. This is the energy of that around that day. The U.S. government had corrupt agents there. Hi, FBI. Can you guys fire them and bring in some good old boys? That's what we want. So there was corruption, we know that. She got the Empress card. We also got Justice Upright. I don't know who's in charge of the FBI these days, but we have to send your good guys back into this Delphi case. We cannot keep doing this. Anyway, we have the Empress. That is a little curious to me because the rest of the cards, except for the Knight of Wands, Chase is a knight. Are all in reverse. Lovers, the moon. Oh, the moon in reverse is secrets are coming out. Lovers in reverse means she hates her husband, probably, I'm guessing. They're both trash, but magician in reverse is like, it can be smoke and mirrors. It's only second grade in the major arcana. It's like, he's in second grade, so... He knows that he was born with all the tools he needs to make his journey, but he hasn't done it. And in reverse, it's like smoke and mirrors. To me, it's always smoke and mirrors. Pentacles in reverse. They were broke. We knew that. Queen of Swords in reverse. This is like an unhinged woman. Anytime the Swords family, like especially the um, courts cards, like, and whenever you see a sword in reverse, this is like, Mentally unstable, which she might be. Dang, man. All right. So Becky just made the list. At this exact moment, she's equal to Mike. 
I um, don't know how long she's going to stay there, but what's her, who's Patty? Oh, that's their last name. I just wrote Patty. Okay. Becky. She might be unhinged, like mentally. There may be some um, mental illness. Yeah, the yada. Also going to put maybe the Empress. So in the pagan world, I'm not speaking about the Norse because I don't know. There's very much a respect for the male and the female. It wasn't until the Christians brought this part patriarchal. So for them to report to an empress, if this is the religion, in just a pagan way, I'm just speaking on a general, it wouldn't be weird. Because, so Becky Patty is the next. We have some jumpers. Oh, we have a lot of jumpers. Okay, so the, the star, yeah, she, her and her husband might have some addiction issues. Knight of Wands. I think our little Chase just got the Knight of Wands. Oh, because he's a wand and... All right, I need to write these guys Chase. I'm going to write Knight, Empress, Empress. Someone got paid to do this. We have the Three of Cups again. This was the triplets. It could be the... All right, let's talk directly to Libby's subconscious. Okay. Oh, if you're new and you're in the balcony, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Um, I don't have a specific number of cards that I always pull. I pull them intuitively, whatever feels right. So I just asked Libby what her subconscious could... If she could speak to us on the day of... Well, we got the world... In reverse, that's an ending, no matter what. Ethan always shows this as him. And we also got Temperance. I heard, I think it was 1111, she uses this as Archangel Michael. We also got the Tower. To me, this means September 11th, and it's like done. Done, done, done. September 11th, to me, our building's falling. I know people have like a nice, easier way of saying it, but that's not the way I read it. She was going to hang out with some of her friends, the BJ Queen. Oh, oh, wait a minute. She was ignoring her intuition. Oh, okay. Hold on. The day that the world ended, she gave us this. So this was her day that it ended. Before this had happened, she was feeling really stressed out. This is our victim. The victim that Corey Richens and the Trash Bucket Mother and D-Bag got a lot. It's a fake to me because of the archetypes that we're working with is a fake. This is little Libby telling us she was really stressed and she just wanted to feel good. And she just wanted to like get some recognition. She'd been working really hard. I don't know what their financial situation was. I'm not seeing any financial cards, but I feel like she was contributing to the family home. Something was, they put a lot of weight on her and that was how she, in the other case, this was D bag and her little boyfriend always had to have outside validation. I'm reading this more as like this little, I mean, these were young girls. She did enjoy the recognition that she got from her family when she was, she shut down emotionally when she was stressed and they really preferred when she was out. She made a phone call or talked to one of her girlfriends, Abby, I'm guessing. And she looks like maybe she asked somebody for a ride, her grandpa, maybe she asked him for a ride and he couldn't do it. He wasn't available. She gets there, she sees her friend, she's so excited. This is like, I love you. This is very genuine to me. We have our thief in the reverse. And that came right before her intuition. This is the BJ Queen. I nicknamed it that one time when I was in the middle of what, like looking into what stuff because she was like very nefarious in there. The um High Priestess is, is your intuition. It's also ride or die, a great friend. It's also yin and yang, Boaz, and I don't remember what their Hebrew name is, but this is night and day. This is like yin and yang. She'll die with your secrets. She'll take them to the grave. You don't ever have to worry about her. But what she showed us was her intuition was speaking to her, and then the tower came. 
something was triggering her intuition. Whoa, this is not good. Stop, stop, stop. And then the tower, the tower's the end to me. Everyone has their own interpretation of it, but to me, it's a 9-11 moment. It's like catastrophic. So her intuition was telling her, this is not good. This is not good. And then her world ends. And her and this is an angelic card to me. Um, we should do a soul path reading on her, actually. So she was feeling her intuition was telling her, stop, stop. And she, you know, might have ignored it. She couldn't get a ride. She had to ask her sister. Oh, cards just jumped and it's the tower on top. The high priestess, the thief. These are all the same cards. I, I didn't, I must not have shuffled them. It's all the same thing in the same order. The tower, the high priestess, the thief, the, my butt, my friend, and my wheel of fortune. I was going to ask about Kelsey. The flu. It's the sun in reverse. They put her sun out. Thief, right here, D-bag, got this. Hold on. I was thinking about asking Kelsey's, what she, like, why? So it looked to me just from that reading that Kelsey took her because her dad was at work or couldn't do it, or her grandpa, whatever they're calling him, Mike. Um, Mike couldn't take her. She'd asked him first. So what... Ask her what she thinks about Kelsey. I don't know. Um, hold on, let me think. What should we know about Kelsey? Okay, good. So, um, we just asked Libby what we should know about Kelsey. The Empress in reverse. She's not our girl. We knew that. <laughs> there is nothing leadership. We have pentacles. We have our friends. Lovers, we knew she had a crush on her, like Chase, or that was her boyfriend at the time. She got paid. There's a little girl, she's dead. Yeah, this is what we got last time. Like, Kelsey, oh, the moon in reverse is good. That secret's coming out. That's this is Kelsey. She was, she, I don't know, she did this for her boyfriend or whatever. Who has a page link to his. Insta called Full Draw Assassins. Hmm. Please do your own investigating. Let me know what you think. That sounds a little bit curious to me. Um, let's ask Kelsey. Oh, overkill. The card just jumped. I didn't ask her a question. Um, and I think Richard Allen's only connection to this entire thing is he being a nice human, developed the Kelsey's pictures and gave them to her for free. I think that's where this connection came from. Back before when the feds were corrupt, before we had like a real team in there. Um, let's ask, oh, so we're asking Libby if she even went to the bridge that day. No, no, yes, no, yes. So that's a soft no. That is exactly what we thought. I'm going to ask her one more time if she actually went to the bridge that day. There's rumors going around that that was um, Disney or NASA made those pictures and they're not even real. And Mike Patty also said that he, her phone was pinging all over town. Curious. Hmm. Um, did you go to the bridge that day. No, yes, no, yes, no. She didn't. We got that, I think, before, too. They didn't go to the bridge that day. So at the time this happened, Chase might have already had, his, had an addiction. Or she's reconfirming that he's, he has a drinking problem. Or whatever. I don't even know how math would show up on the card, so I guess, it, I mean, it's all relative, probably. Moon is the secrets coming out. The high Priestess in reverse. You never want your High Priestess in reverse. He is like a very, um, 
combative personality. I wonder if this has anything to do with the full-drawn assassins. Sure, it's a bird hunting crew. Sure. Actually, let's just ask the cards. Is full-drawn assassins... Full-drawn assassins. Is full-drawn assassins... Nefarious. No, 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 yes. No, it's hard now. Oh, you know what we should do? Is it connected to the cult of Odin or the Odinites? Full drawn assassins, are they connected to the Odinites? Something about this full drawn assassins, though. I'm not asking the questions right. Do we need to know about the full drawn assassins? Oh, all right. We just got it. All right. So the full drawn assassins is like the cover for the corruption. We have the emperor and the hierophant in reverse. It's the cover. Even justice is in reverse. Are they sending in the good guys? Yeah, I think we did get that. Queen of Swords, here's our crazy. This is a female who's like completely unhinged. It did show up for Becky. So we're going to give Becky our Queen of Swords for today, right now. And I'm going to put that on here because I've done her twice. There's money behind this. And there's someone with power. There's a contract in reverse. People are getting left out in the cold. Maybe that's because the good, the good boys are, or the good guys are coming. Yeah, they're losing pentacles. We have the king and queen of pentacles. Who are the money bags in this town? I think it's the same guy who owns the property. He looks just like Richard Allen. We have our page of wands. This is our um, chase. So the patterns that we're starting to see, here's a contract in reverse. Chase is our page of wands. No, no, no. I'm sorry. He's the knight of wands, but our page is a runner. And Becky. Corruption, corruption, corruption are the Hierophant, the Emperor, and Justice in reverse. We know, obviously, there's someone here running this with money. Mom, um, female and a male. I hate seeing corruption. There's like nowhere to go when you have corruption. But that's why the good old boys, these are formerly known as the Hot Cowboys. Well, they weren't really, but... Okay. So... <laughs> Wait a second. So the cards that we just got was the sun. We have four cup cards. So fives are, can be grief. The organization is feeling grief. They were feeling bountiful. This can be also gluttony, but they're also fat and happy. We also have walking away from it all and fleeting happiness. Around them, we have the three. This is like, either be patient or leave. This is the three of wands. Yeah. In reverse, where are other ones? We have the eight of wands. This is like flight, fight, 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 flight mode. We also have the seven of wands in reverse. This is like, everything here is stop except this is a flight mode, like fight, flight mode. Those are our wands. We have the swords in reverse. So we have the 10 of swords in reverse. And the knight in reverse. <laughs> so the organization as a whole, the sun is about to shine on it. The sun shining. We have the Empress. This might be run by a woman again. And the organization is like, I almost want to say it's getting choked again, just like the Moscow case. The party goods and favors that were traveling um, might not be traveling. 
Ace of Swords just jumped. It's a new beginning. It could also be like a doctor, like a um, surgery kind of a card. Empress in reverse, and we have the Knight of Pentacles. The sun, it's dark there, judgment, justice. Oh, good, we have justice. <laughs> so what I'm getting right now is the organization is like trying to come back. They're trying to figure out how they can do this and stay under the radar. They're thinking of new ideas. They have a Knight of Pentacles. He's steady and sturdy. Our Empress might have already fallen or is falling. The sun is hidden. This is being done in the dark. That's why like all of us are all of a sudden, or I mean, a lot of people have had their eyes on this, but now it's like, the way they're treating to my, in my experience, in my own, in my opinion, the way they're treating Richard Allen is bringing way more attention to this and they're doing it because I'm surprised our Nazi didn't show up. See here. Um, they're doing, they're dehumanizing him. Whether you think he's guilty or not, that doesn't matter. He's still a human. And then we have our against free will and spells. So spells, spells, spells. This has come up a lot. If they're working with black magic, which it looks like they are. Um, they are like, yeah, I'm going to say yes, they're using black magic. I mean, you say it because we have these two cards. Famous Fortune got this is spell casting and this is darkness. This is like getting choked again. Oh, that would make sense. But that also makes sense why Ethan's back. The Hermit. This is like when we started figuring out the organization and the communications the night of the Idaho Four. Your Hermit is bringing light into the darkness. He's a sage. He's smart. He's smarter than most of these yahoos. And we have the Hierophant Upright. We always, in the context of these cases, we always want to see our Hierophant Upright because this is not corruption. They got rid of those losers. The FBI, the feds, the federal government got rid of the losers who should be fired themselves, but that's my own opinion. Um, the Hierophant Upright, to me, is a good boy. That's the good old boys. That's who we want to see with the sage and the thief. They're tracking all of their communications. I know that this doesn't always mean internet. Swords usually does to me. This is like an internet communications card. They're tracking their code. They have it. They know there is money and our page of swords. Um, Chase was the knight of wands. This is a page of swords in reverse. So anytime you have like a card in reverse, it's backwards. It's the reverse of what it was. This is like anxiety, stress. This is a money card. What? How? Uh, 10. Oh, this is completion. <laughs> All right. There's some hope here. We have hope. We have our Hierophant and the Sage next to the Sage, next to the Thief. So our Hierophant is shining a light on the Thief through electronic communications. This is a little boy in the field. Four is our foundational card, Four of Cups. In reverse, it's like stop and be still process. Like you guys can, the Hierophant is shining light on this case. And you need to be still. They're following, they're watching you. This is a completion. It's done. You guys, your game is over. And this is like, be silent. Shut up. Stop talking. Okay, so we have a pondering. That's three. Trinity um, could be the chase. I don't think he plays a huge role 
in this organization right now. We're looking at it as the whole of the organization. We finally have hope. Page of Wands is Chase again. We have the Queen of Swords, who has been coming up in reverse. We have our contracts. Temperance was in reverse. These guys are fucked. <laughs> Fleeting happiness. Ah, thank you. I, I know I said I had never been so proud to be an American except for September 11th, the Idaho case. And now, right now, there's like hope. Before we were just getting stagged. There was no hope. It was all corrupt. There was nothing. So the, the organization, as it knows itself, is getting infiltrated by uncorrupt government agents, which is like just a wonderful thing. What do we need to know about the organization? Okay. Okay. This is our fire sign. This is a hermit in reverse. We don't want the hermit in reverse. For this context, it's fine. Temperance. Contracts in reverse. Baby. This is our baby card. Queen of Swords. <sighs> Becky. It's very unstable. Mentally unstable. This is like becoming unhinged. They did get rid of the corruption. FBI. Whoever was working with the feds on a federal level on this case, who interviewed Kelsey seven times and cleared her, those guys are gone. That's done. There's, the corruption is gone. Justice is finally coming. Temperance, this is angelic. One foot in, one foot out. Heartbreak, this could be the triplet, uh, not our triplets here, but it could be the government or the organization as a whole is feeling heartbreak. They were. Overworked. Here's our new beginning. Contracts. Oh, I'm sorry. This is the new baby. New beginning. Pondering. Looking towards the past. What should we do? What should we do? Ace of Pentacles. Contracts. They're not working. Money isn't working. And our really unhinged Queen of Swords. And we have a Knight of Cups. He's emotional. The organization, as it knows, knew itself is completely falling apart. The corruption is gone. That's awesome. Okay, good. That's good. Those are good ways. That's a good way to end it right now. Um, in recap, we have figured out that Abby, the girls, did not want to go to the bridge. Chase was not the dad of Abby's baby. The grandpa is not the emperor. The grandpa's name is Mike Patty. He is involved and he reports to someone higher than him. The grandma, her name is Becky Patty. She's the queen of swords. She's also involved. She has shown up um, perhaps mentally completely unhinged. Um, Brianne Wilbur was Kelsey's best friend. I didn't get much from her. I didn't feel her energy at all. but. She was. She is in a sorority, Alpha Sigma Alpha. Chase Wilbur, I thought he was hot. Um, he is our Knight of Wands today. He is associated with full drawn assassins. That's right underneath the Christian part of his Instagram. Um, Becky Patty is highly involved in this, and it's very much. She's not mentally stable. I can just say that because she's been the queen of swords. As for a hierarchy so far, the hierophant was empty because we had our, um, it was corrupt. So this didn't matter. Like I saw an article that Kelsey got interviewed seven times by the FBI. You don't have to be an FBI agent or anything to know that was full blown. So the, I'm guessing they got rid of them because we have the Hierophant back up, right? And he's back in charge. Um, the Emperor is the dark side, and it always has been in the last two cases. Uh, this is saying that we have Mike, Patty. Oh, sorry. Mike, Patty, Becky, Patty, Chase, Kelsey. Um, 
we asked the organization, it's falling apart from the inside. They have infiltrated, they got rid of the um, corrupt agents that were working there. The U.S. government is bringing justice, the sun, and order. It's a lot to ask. And then I think that's it for our recap. If you're in the bleachers, thank you for coming. If you hung out with me here, thanks for coming. That was fun. I have more questions, but what I want to do is upload this so that you guys can have it and then perhaps do some more. But that's what we got today. And again, in recap, Becky and Mike Patty, 100% involved. I don't think either one of them, so far, Mike is not the head of it or anything, but he does report to someone higher. Becky has potential to either be higher than him or a key decision maker. The girls probably didn't actually even go to the bridge. I saw something that Disney or NASA might have made those videos. And Chase is our Knight of Wands. He's, I think, a fire sign. If anyone actually finds his birthday, please let me know. And with that, I will love you and leave you. And thank you so much for coming.